play te technologic gaming here. Um, yeah, I'm under a new channel name now, so that that's new. But uh, welcome to Derail Valley. Derail Valley. Uh, all validated that. Um, this is such a cool game. I, I have this thing with trains anyway. I have since I was born, essentially. But um, it's always been my dream to like do the whole steam train thing. I love steam engines. Steam engines more so than diesels. But uh, you know. Um, but what you're going to be seeing here is um, the. Uh, job from the steel mill to the harbor and town station way down there in the bottom right corner of the map and uh, well, the route we're going to be taking we're going to be going from here and we go down hitting these crossings and then going across here and then it'll be a straight shot from there pretty much let's see well no we need to go up and around oh a little bit of lag right there uh, That's still the shortest route, I believe. Doesn't matter. Doesn't really matter anyway. But you'll be seeing that job because okay. So we need four steel, four cars of steel rails. That is these duders here, and we're going to be using the steam engine for this because why the heck not? Um, allow myself to center myself. Wait for it to center. There we go. Okay. Ugh, okay, so if you haven't seen this game before, welcome. I'll t I'll talk you through the steps. Um, if you're wondering why I'm in this corner, uh, your left corner of the webcam, it's because uh, the way my guardian system works, because my room is kind of small, uh, to be able to shovel the coal and stuff like that, I have to be over in this corner so the rift or the rift guardian system doesn't like glitch out and whatever. So that's why. So sorry about that, but I can't do it any other way. Anyway, I mean, you go forward. Okay, this is your reverser. You want this to be all the way forward. Uh, that all the way forward is forward. All the way down to there is from here up. The further up you go, more power. The further down you go, the more speed, but the less power up uh, hills and pulling pulling yourself up hills and stuff. Then past that midline further down that's reverse and then same goes for the way up here works too so uh, all the way forward uh, this is your break don't touch that whistle cord this is the best part of the game <laughs> uh, so first you're gonna want to open up the water wait till it gets to right about there and there we go okay so uh, second open up your fire door um, let's see. Um, 10 out of 10 sound design for this game. It's amazing. Uh, get your shovel and proceed by getting, shoveling coal into your firebox. And, and once you get to the to right about, I believe that's enough. Huh? Kind of got to sling it for me. Because, okay, that should be good right there. Uh, let me just you can just grab your spare pieces of coal and just toss it. Yeah, it's my drum set. Sorry. <laughs> um, just grab your spare pieces of coal and just toss them in there. Like that. Uh, make sure we're centered. Okay. So from now, you're going to want to make sure everything works, so sander, sander won't work until you have steam, brake, that works, whistle cord won't work until you have steam, that's fine, that's your steam gauge, I'm not sure what this is, this is your sand gauge, and this is your brake gauges, uh, and that's your speed. Uh, so um, what you're going to want to do from there is you're going to open up this, 
grab your lighter, open it up, and then just chuck it in. Oh, hot, 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 hot. And you're going to wait for the steam to build up to at least three before you want to pull anything. But when you're just like this, it doesn't take that much, so release your brake. Keep yourself forward. And just wait a second until it gets about halfway to three. That should be good right there. Okay. And now what you're going to do is, um, regulations for railroading and stuff like that is two uh, short whistles for forward, so. Okay, that's two. Let go of your brake, push your throttle up a little bit, and kind of punch it until you see yourself start moving. And then when you start moving, bring your throttle back so you just kind of glide forward. And she should be pulling out of the station like so. Um, what what we're doing right now is we're pulling it out and we're going to back it up into the sidings once we get way up there. So, um, so we just have to wait for that. Check our vicinity. What's cool is that this is a 2A2 and uh, I live about an hour and a half away from a park in East Tennessee called Dollywood. They have two 2A2 narrow gauge Mikados that work on the White Pass and Yukon Railway, of which I've actually got to ride on before. So, uh, throw on your brakes into, let's see, and then once you get relatively close, kind of let go of your brake about most of the way and then punch your punch your throttle a little bit look at your thing there's our and there we are in range we have made contact nice and smooth and click the green button to couple up now we should checking one two three four steel rails all loaded down and ready to go. Okay, so uh, once we're about ready to uh, get started here, get some. Want to keep your coal being shoveled and just keep shoveling it in. Keep it hot. Keep the fire hot so you fire don't die in the middle of a climb up the hill and lose a crap ton of steam. Just do that. Keep your life a lot easier. Okay. Uh, making sure I'm still centered. Okay, there we go. Okay, so we are ready. So let's get some more water. Dump a little bit more steam. I hope we have enough water for this whole trip. If we don't, we'll be in trouble. Because no water means no steam. So let's go ahead and cut that off because. That will give us a little, a little bit of reserve for if we do. Okay, so put on your brake. Uh, I believe we're ready. So two whistles make it a little louder because you're going to be going forward, way forward. So. Right. I'm going to get your reverser forward and let go of your brake. And punch your throttle up about a notch before. Let yourself just start moving. You can feel it click with your control, you can feel your controller vibration go. I'm going to turn down my game 
volume real quick, so please excuse this. There we go, that's a little better. So again, make sure you're a little bit below or right at 20. Um, from here on, you should be good for a little bit until you get to your first crossing, which is this one up here. And you can just ignore these, these up here. So, uh, check to make sure that you have passed crossings from the station so you don't derail. Alright, let's give it some gas and we'll start speed. Do that. Yeah. Alright, once you're moving, let's give her a good blow. train of about nine cars, you have you have to have your throttle all the way up or you won't make this hill. It's nasty. Look at our speed if like at our coal. Yeah. yeah we're gonna need that coal too. Air bogging down. That's a sign of I don't have my throttle all the way up. Push it. Little wheel slip right here. Turn on your sand so you don't slip if you go too fast. This is going to be a mix of uphill and downhill, so you're going to have some right here. First crossing is up here. Don't go too far away from your engine or else your cars will despawn, and that's just not fun. takes you to the farm, or not the farm, but the, uh, the uh, forest south. So just make sure that your cars are still on to avoid derailment. One, two, three, four cars of steel rails. Yep. Yeah. Alright. Alright, 
so if you notice we're going up just a little bit of a grade. Just, uh, just, we are going the correct direction. And then we need to take another left. This is going to be a big uphill battle. Constant throttle control. Back home, not much. Just let her glide. Just let her glide and keep your hand on the brake. Keep in mind this game is in early access, so the reason why it's laggy is just because it's not completely refined yet, so everything's looking good. Too sharp, and I hope I didn't jump too far up. No, I didn't. Sure. If you jump too far ahead of your cars and it loads another chunk in before your train can catch up, your, your cars will just disappear. The engine will still be here, but the cars behind it will just poof, disappear. Oh. Okay, let's see. 
Uh, which direction are you going? You're going that way. We need to go to... Uh, right. That way. Through that tunnel. Okay. Right. Okay, just going forward. Something stained again. there. After this, we don't have anywhere else other crossing. Do we need? No, we do not. I get a little bit of a push. Come on. Come on. There we go. Okay. It's enough to start this coast down.
that one, ladies and gentlemen. 107. West. That's west. That's east. So, so on the west side. Gentlemen, harbor and town. No, oh, we are on the west side. Whoa, their partner slow it on down there. Okay. Uh, okay. Alright, so let's see. It's the first right. All that says is that open siding. I thought I turned you off. Never mind. Um, let's see. So, so is that one. That one happens to be the one in there. Alright. We are good to go. Okay, let me just... Forward. Okay. We don't need a lot of steam while we're going into a station, I don't think. Or a freight yard. Too far. There we go. Then to signify uh, you have stopped one long bloat. Like that. Make sure your brakes on, throttles out, and everything is good. Go ahead and dump your steam. Steam doesn't matter anymore. Alright, and uh, the other thing you want to do is actually Leave some steam, as in you can use your blower to get the fire out. It'll put the fire out relatively quickly. Okay. So let's see. We need to uncouple first, though. Let's see. Uh, oop. Oop. Oh, wait. boy okay so now let's head over to the I need to, I'm gonna stop what there's a steam engine already here hmm. I didn't know that they would let you have steam engines over on this side okay whatever that's fine uh, let's see we need to put our thing in the job evaluation do hickey or job validation thingy yay we got it Give me my moolahs. Ah, okay. Complete. Oh, just a little under an hour. Now let's see. Let me put you there. Right now. And this report can just uh, go over there somewhere. Bye. You can go in my... Yeah, that's nice. Okay. Woohoo! 
Let's check to see if there's why am I so tall? Let me recenter my thing. Nope, I guess I'm just tall because I'm tall. Uh, another thing in here that I want to buy that I can buy. I think I will buy this though, the longer train. No, first we'll do the thing. Um, but uh, that does it for this video, everybody. Thank you for watching. Uh, I had a lot of fun with this actually. Hope you learned something and uh, how to. Uh, if you have this game, it's only 20 bucks. I'd recommend you go get it. It's a lot of fun. You can. There's a 2D non-VR mode, so you don't have to have an Oculus Rift or an HTC Vive to run it. Um, the only downside is that you can't blow the whistle or horn vice versa from the train or the diesel locomotive as far as I know because there hasn't been an update about it yet. So, um, yeah, that's the only thing that you can't do in the 2D version. Um, other, than, other than that, um, it's pretty much the exact same thing except you don't get the cool VR experience because this is the, the 3D is just amazing. So, um, yeah, so this was... Uh, Derail Valley, Oculus Rift, uh, with the touch controllers, and this was the uh, steel, uh, the steel uh, factory, steel mill to harbor and town haul run uh, for the full four steel rails, and uh, yeah, so uh, thank you all for watching. Uh, make sure to like, rate, comment, share, and subscribe. And I will see you all in the next video. Bye-bye.